What's up, guys? Redneck Days in here. Myrtle Beach. We're in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. Last minute. A whole hoochie bunch of my peoples in here. My kids and my wife, mama law. They're, they're playing some. They're playing Uno. <laughs> anyway, so you know when you ain't got well, we do have a grill, but it's been raining all day. So we decided we bought it. We bought us a pork butt uh, shoulder. And uh, we decided to do a, try a pressure cooker pork butt. We've done it before, but not a whole like that. And uh, we used, oh, Insta, that's an old one. We've had that forever. So two hours, basically we did 90 minutes, of added a little water, basically two cup water max. Rubbed it down with mustard and, uh, um, well, Dijon and um, butt rub. Good stuff. Especially when you're doing pork butt, because you don't want to spend it, uh, you don't, you don't want to put, I mean, when you're doing it in a pressure cooker, you just want flavor, and that's what it produced. So anyway, let's get to it. Uh, the little kitchen, <laughs> little kitchen in our little suite. Um, refrigerator packed full of everything. Uh, essentials. Uh, there's my essential. <laughs> so anyway, uh, I just pulled this as a butt to bone clean out, and uh, there you go. Pulled pork, uh, no smoke ring, but we use smoke liquid smoke and uh this is my i like this shit my kids like it that's the main thing i like vinegar base too and my boy brandon wallace has got the best vinegar base around but this is uh more like a sweet got this it's got smoke in it too and then the smoke man this let me show you something let me show y'all something let show y'all something let me show y'all something you see there You don't need, you don't have to have a smoker to make some good damn pork butt, pulled pork. That's the whole point. And y'all know I don't have saliva. I'm swallowing it without a drink. Good stuff. And we're doing, the kids are going to do Hawaiian roll sliders with that. We got. I've never had this. Let me know what y'all think. At Publix, we don't have a Publix where I live, and we love Publix chicken salad. When I, when we're in Myrtle Beach, we always get chicken salad. They were out, so we got the sweet coleslaw, and their southern take on potato salad. They got all kinds. New York, all kinds. Hey, Melissa, can't do this one hand. Can't do that. Can you open this for me? I want to give them a take on my what I think about their Publix's uh, stuff. They don't seen that damn and and Mrs. Beast. I mean Mrs. Redneck Asian put 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 the put the hammer on that that, that roast pork. Um, I just I pull it apart and uh, sauce it up. All right. So this is the oh we gotta do it that way. Yeah. Hold on. Give me a second. All right. So. Let me get a mouth. Ah! Mm. It's actually pretty good. That's weird. I know no better. That tastes just like KFC. Get some more of that. That is crazy. Hey. hey. That slaw tastes just like KFC slaw. That's crazy. <coughs> All right, let's try them. That's the southern potato. Pickle. Damn. I can't wait to publish comes to Wilson, North Carolina. Their potato salad is way better than food lines. And I make my own usually, but when I'm in a pinch, I like to go grab it. That's just as good as any I've had. That's crazy. We think about them salt up. That is some short. Yeah, there's a short smoke seasoning on that fry rice. Right? Oh, oh, come out with a hot. Woo. 
All right, I'm gonna make me a plate, fill my belly up, and then fill my cup up. Anyway, subscribe, like, cause I like you. And I wish if y'all in Myrtle Beach, hit me up. I'm here for seven days. In heaven, hit that bell. Be a part of the notification.